Chris Atkinson is at home on the gravel tracks and narrow country lanes across the world as part of the Proton Factory Rally Squad. As well as competing at the highest level of the sport, he has also experienced a wide range of vehicles on race tracks across Australia. The one race car he hadn't sampled was a V8 supercar. Now he has that box ticked, taking the wheel of Russell Ingalls super cheap auto racing Holden at Queensland Raceway. Kept my skill sharp, I was sideways a few times, so that was uh, probably the main thing. Um, I think rally cars are so completely different, it's hard to cross over, and V8 supercars is very unique, and the guys that do this uh, are fantastic at what they do. The 2005 V8 supercar champion, happy to give the rally star a steer of his 635 brake horsepower Commodore. He knows what he's doing, and uh, he said he got in a few slides. I said, well, if there's anyone that's going to catch a slide... It'll be, yeah, <laughs> there'll be no problems at all because uh, he's used to going sideways more so than a straight line. The difference between a four-wheel drive rally car and the V8 were numerous. You've got to be really gentle actually, like even though it's a V8 supercar and it's all about muscle cars that, compared to what I do in rallying, I'm a lot more aggressive with my driving here, obviously you've got to be a lot smoother, a lot more gentle on the throttle and, and uh, I think it'll take me a few more laps to get used to it. In October, the Armourall Gold Coast 600 will feature internationally regarded co-drivers. Atkinson would fit the qualifying criteria and Ingle believes there could be a future for the rally ace in V8s. You'd have to give him plenty of laps. I mean, bitumen racing is, is quite a bit different. But, you know, technique-wise, I mean, I mean he's, used to, he's used to racing at the highest level of motorsport there is, so he could pick it up in a flash. So, look, I'm sure with a couple of practice days, uh, he could match it with anyone. So I'd actually really like to see him out there. Atkinson hits the dirt tracks in New Caledonia in a fortnight. While over the same weekend, the V8s will be in the top end for the Sky City Triple Crown.